Hey guys, welcome back. It's Elise. As always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below if you want to. And welcome to Vlogmas Day... This might be six or seven, I think. Okay, today is my shoe collection. So this came recommended by, I think, two people. And I was like, oh, that's actually a really great idea. I never thought to like show you guys what my shoes were, but I've got them all kind of laid out right here. And I also made myself a coffee with some peppermint mocha creamer in it. And it's so good. So yeah, let's start with this side. Okay, so um, these are volleyball shoes I'm not using right now. I actually have another pair, but they are in my volleyball bag. And if I take them out, everything is actually should I just take them out? I'll just take them out. I forgot shoes. Okay, I'm gonna go grab the rest of my shoes and then I'll be back to you. Okay, so I'm back with some more shoes. You can't see all of them. Could you move? I love you, but move. Uh, anyways, I'm back with some more shoes. Um, some of them are very dirty, so I usually keep them like outside in our garage because I wear them to like play soccer with my sister or go for a run in the grass or like walk the dog, you know? Kind of those shoes. Anyways, we'll start with this side again. So these three pairs are my volleyball shoes. Um, this blue Adidas pair was my very first pair of volleyball shoes and they still fit me. I got them like two sizes too big, so they still fit. And then these Mizuno ones were my second pair. And then these are my high school shoes. They, they match my high school team, so that's super cool. I actually really like them. They take a while to break in, but they are cute in my opinion. Um, next we have my Airwalk Doc Martens. I think they're super cute. The only thing about them is they kind of creased really quickly. It surprised me. Um, they're not super uncomfortable either. I heard they were super uncomfortable. They're not that bad. You just kind of have to break them in a little bit. And my sister has actually been wearing them a lot, so. I found another pair and I'm not exactly sure what they're called, but they don't have the laces and they're really cute. They're like boots, almost like these. And I'm very interested in them, so. I think I'll probably give these to my sister if I get a new pair. Here, we'll go down here. So I have this pair of like little pink boots I got from, I think it's a boutique near me, you know, support local. They're really cute. They've got like this, like these holes in the shoes and they zip up on the side and there's a heel on the inside of them. You can kind of see if I like, it goes about to right there. Um, they're really cute on, I love them. Um, I usually wear them to like church, but I haven't in a while. So doing this is kind of reminding me of some shoes I forgot about. Okay. Um, next we have these boots. I think I got them at like TJ Maxx. They're Tommy Hilfiger's. They're really cute. Um, they have this, this little like plaid detailing on them and then they've got like the little loops and yeah, they're like almost this velvety material on the outside. The stitching on them is very nice. I really like them. And then lastly on the rack are my Sperry Duck Boots. Okay, these things are literally so cute in the fall or in the winter. Um, I really like to wear them when we go like to downtown Gatlinburg on a trip I usually go with. The only problem I had with them is I had these cute little like, they come with these cute little ties on them. And on my other one, they came undone, so I tried to retie them. This one looks all right, but this one, it's struggling. So I think I can take them in and I'll just redo the laces or I can just buy new ones, but that was really the only problem I had with them. And it's because I wore them in the snow sledding when they're really not like snow boots, but it's okay. I did not put those in there all the way. Excuse me. Okay, next thing are my Air Force Ones. They're not customized. I got them at Dick's House of Sports and they're like really cute. They've got this pink swoosh on them. The laces are pink. And then they say Air Force Ones with four stars on them. And then the back is like this almost deep coral color. Yeah. I wear these all the time. If you watch like my vlogs all the time, like to school every single day. For a while I would like wear different shoes, but then I just like. Okay, next. Um, these are my running shoes. I used them for track last year in middle school and they're disgusting to say the least, but I usually use them to go running in because I like the cushion on them. They work well for me. And I played soccer with my sister. Needless to say, it was in white grass and now they're disgusting. 
Um, I also have my Adidas NMD R1s. They're really, really cute. I love them, but they kind of started peeling. I wore them all year last year and the back kind of started peeling off. So it's time to probably retire these shoes, but I think I can still get a little bit more use out of them. Moving on to my other rack, I have these adorable little heels. They actually, it's like a cross strap right here. I really love them. I wear them to like all formal, formal dances I have just because they're comfortable. And believe it or not, I got them at Target on sale one time and they were like $12. I don't know, I'll ask my mom and I'll put the number on the screen. But yeah, they're so cute. And like this strap crosses, so this goes around your so this goes around your ankle and this goes around like the top of your foot, like right here. Okay. The next thing we have are these little leopard flats, which I also got from Target a while ago. I think I got them when like we first moved here, which was a long time ago. So I don't know that you'll be able to find them again, but I love them and they've lasted so long and they're kind of cute for like church or if you need to throw it on and kind of like spice up an outfit or I feel like these are good for like some kind of interviews, you know? Okay, we cannot forget about the Chacos. Um, these you can wear in the water and like lakes. They're very nice or like tubing. Um, they're really good if you're gonna go to like a camp that's like in the woods and you're gonna run through grass and everything. Yeah, I really love them. They're comfortable. They make them without the toe straps and you can get like just really thick straps, but these are mine. And the inside is like a zebra print. So super cool, super cool. Okay, right here we have my Birkenstocks. These are the Yaras and they go on your foot and then they like wrap around your ankle. So like, they go like that. Um, I haven't worn them in a while. I think I've outgrown them a little bit and they did start peeling. So I went ahead and got a new pair which brings me to my, oh, I don't know what these are called. I'll put the name of them on the screen. But they're the ones with the toe strap. I really, really like them. Um, they're just basic, they're cute, and they're easy to slip on. Uh, I call these my Egyptian shoes because I feel like they're Egyptian sandals. I don't know. Um, they're really pretty. They've got this like gold and than like the shaping on them, super cute. I've worn them to church a few times in my vlogs. A lot of these shoes that like I would not wear to school or out shopping, I wear to church a lot. Um, yeah, they're from the brand New Direction and I think I got them at Belk a few years ago. Um, underneath them are these Michael Kor flats. Um, they're a lot like my Birkenstocks and they're just like this little silicone Thing. They do get kind of dirty quickly, but you can wash them off really easily with just like some soapy water because of the material they are. Okay, these shoes are actually my mom's and some people I had seen like wearing them, some influencers, and I told her, I was like, those are really cute. I was like, I think they're going back in style. She was like, oh, you can have them. So I tried them on and they fit. I just have not worn them yet, but they're from High Sierra. I don't know, but I think they're super cute. Um, I may get to wearing them at some point. Um, the last thing on the shelves are these little flats with this little ruffle. They're almost denim. And you're gonna think this is crazy, but I got them at Cracker Barrel. Who would have thought? Um, yeah, I was just there with my grandma. We were getting a pickup order and I saw them and they were $13 and she was like, get them. And I did, and they fit really nice. The, yeah. They're just so cute. They're from the brand Indigo Soul. And I have them in a size nine, but they're like perfect for the 4th of July. They're like cute summer sandals. I don't know, I love them. Okay, moving on to the ground, we have my infamous Ugg slippers. I have them in the marble print and I got them on Amazon. So yeah, super cute. And they are so comfortable. I love them. The inside fur is actually softer than the outside, I think. Maybe not, but. And then lastly, we have my Crocs. I have had these for the longest time and I have my gibbets in them. I have a coffee cup because I like coffee, um, an avocado because I can eat avocados just plain 
and I like, I really like guacamole. Um, I like avocado toast. Yeah, avocados are my favorite. And then there's a little pizza with pepperoni hearts because I love pizza. Um, this was my number a while ago and then just a volleyball because I like playing ball volleyball and I slipped them on after. Okay, so that is my shoe collection. Um, thanks for watching. As always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below if you liked it and if you want to. And I will see you in tomorrow's video.